All right, what is up YouTube? Degenerate Collector coming to you today from Moreno Valley. We're gonna check out the FYE, see what kind of action figures they've got. Maybe they've got NECA, Reaction, all kinds of stuff. So come with me and let's do this. So check this out guys. We have found Micro Comics, the world's smallest masters of the universe comic. This is supposed to be a replica of the comics that came with the current origins and old school Masters of the Universe figures. This is series one and it looks like there's maybe six of these coming out. But there's a whole section of world's smallest we've got world's smallest uno cards hungry hungry hippos and if we spin around the world's smallest ouija board care bear and hello kitty all right guys so here we are we're on the toy section in fye we don't have an FYE back in North Carolina, so this should be a nice treat for us to look at this and see what we have not seen back at home. So let's check this out. And here we go. Here is the NECA section. We've got Predator Concrete Jungle. Here's the Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. Universal monsters that just keep popping up everywhere. Here's the Hunchback. Here is the Bill and Ted, the Wild Stallions. Never seen this before. Probably an FYE exclusive. We've got Mall Rats. If I don't knock the shelf over, this is supposed to be Silent Bob, but in some kind of black and white animation style. And there's Jay back there. And this is something that I have not seen in the wild anywhere yet. I've seen the stuffed version, but I have not seen the ALF NECA figure. So we are definitely going to have to crack this open and see what he looks like. 50 bucks for ALF now. NECA prices are starting to increase. Here we see ALF sitting on the couch and the accessories he comes with. He comes with his big uh, submarine sandwich, bowl of popcorn. Of course, that's uh, supposed to look like a Pepsi Cola. And of course, being NECA figures, he comes with the extra hands. And there is the, I'm not sure what that is. It's a microphone with like an amplifier. Maybe when he was trying to do ham radio, but this should really come with Lucky the cat because he was always trying to eat the family cat. So cool piece. All right, over here, guys, we've got a, a Garbage Pail Kids 1000 piece puzzle. There you can see Adam Bomb, right in the dead center. Pretty cool puzzle, but they're not, they're not calling it Garbage Pail Kids anymore. Now they're just calling it GPK. I guess maybe Garbage Pail Kids is, well, I'm wrong, I'm wrong. It says it right here on the side of the box, Garbage Pail Kids. It's just like the logo now there, just abbreviating it to GPK. We swing around here. We can see some of the reaction figures already clearancing out. Like we've got the Transformers here for $9.88. And it gets even better. Here we've got one for for six bucks. And yeah, it just keeps going and going and going. Here's uh from the movie, Galvatron, $9.88. Looks like they're all basically being clearanced out. G.I. Joe reaction figures are going the same way. 
Snake Eyes in the blue outfit, $7.38. Looks like it's all Snake Eyes. Well, no, we've got Scarlet back here for $7.38. And there's Quinn. We found him in the storage unit a couple of weeks back. And there is Scarlet yet again. Let's just kind of give a quick overhaul. Some of the Spider-Man figures. Fantastic Four on clearance for $22. Even some of the uh, Star Wars figures. And this is what we were just talking about the other day at Target. It was time for these guys to start hitting clearance and Lo and behold, here we are. We've even got uh, Moon Knight. Go check this one out. We've got the Toxic Avenger. We've got a pink Frankenstein. Then we've got the pink Wolfman. And behind him, there is a another Wolfman. See, I'm not familiar too much with Star Wars, but this appears to be like a, I would have called it an R2-D2, but it's not. It's an R2-SHW. Looks like R2-D2, only red. Then we've got a War Machine Iron Man on clearance. I've never seen these before. Here is the reaction done figures. I'm familiar with the LJN series, but haven't seen the reaction ones yet. And funny enough, the first time I see them, they're on clearance. It's pretty cool. So here is something very unusual, Garbage Pail Kids tarot card deck and guidebook. We've seen the Britney Spears one and now we've seen Garbage Pail Kids. Here's the uh, Creep Show comic book. I actually own this, but it's, it's still pretty cool to see when you're out and about. We've got a giant like head knocker bobblehead of Pennywise, a talking Chucky, standard NECA creep show figure. Here is a huge Nightmare on Elm Street 2 Freddy Krueger figure as well as a massive creep show figure in the back and they are joined by Pennywise then of course you can have your Freddy versus Jason hot sauce and a Sam bobblehead more tarot anime tarot and a Stranger Things tarot deck and here's a leprechaun trick-or-treat paint-by-number set. So that wraps up our toy hunt at FYE. If you like this video, be sure to smash that like button, leave comments below, let me know what you'd like to see on this channel, like, comment, subscribe, all that good stuff, and until next time, I'm going to keep trying to figure it out.